There is no doubt that shale gas is a game changer. We talk about it as being a game changer here in our region. It's a game changer nationally, and I would argue that it's a game changer globally. I don't believe that the United States was the only part of the world that was blessed with shale gas. So if you think about emerging economies like China and India, and eventually emerging economies in Africa, we're going to see shale gas being produced on a global basis. What we have right now, though, is a head start on this opportunity, a head start to be the producer and supplier of natural gas, potentially on a global basis. We can supply energy to our friends, our friends in Europe, uh, to our allies, our, our, our allies in Asia, Japan, um, and we've got a head start on that as I said before, because we have the infrastructure, at least we have the infrastructure in part. We need to build out some more, which means jobs here in the United States. So we need to build these LNG terminals, we need to build pipelines, of course we need to, to produce the natural gas, which means drilling, and a lot of jobs associated with that. And it gives us an opportunity to move this gas over into Europe and Asia. But it doesn't mean that we won't have the gas here in the United States because there's a big price difference. To liquefy it and move it to Asia is going to cost anywhere from on the low end $3, maybe on the high end $6 or $7. So that's a basis difference that we can enjoy here in the United States, which I think allows us to bring back manufacturing onto our shores. And that's another game changer for this area. If you think about what we have in the western Pennsylvania, West Virginia, Ohio area, we've got low cost electricity, we've got abundant natural gas, we've got water resources which our friends out west don't have and a lot of time that's, that's undervalued. We've got a workforce that knows how to build things and we've got a university system second to none that can produce the engineers, the technicians, the chemists, that we need to bring manufacturing back into this area. This is our time and we need to take advantage of it.